Hello guys and welcome to another E4 History video. Today I'm going to gain some Turkish fans by talking about Suleiman the Magnificent. I've also brought some popcorn for the comment section, so make sure to get some yourself. Suleiman was born in 1494 and was son of Selim I, who was sultan at the time. At a young age, he was sent to study in Constantinople, where he learnt about science, history, and military tactics. This teaching would later help him to become one of the most famous sultans in history. At the age of 26, Suleiman rode into Constantinople and ascended to the throne upon his father's death. He then started a series of military conquests. Initially, Suleiman was very successful due to capturing the island of Rhodes and made considerable territory gains into Hungary. Many countries began to fear the Ottomans, especially when Suleiman killed King Louis of Hungary at the Battle of Mohawks in 1526. He then came into direct conflict with the Habsburgs over the territories of Hungary, since the Holy Roman Emperor's brother, Ferdinand, claimed to be King of Hungary. The Ottomans campaigned further into Europe, but were defeated in Vienna in 1529, when they had to lift the siege, and later at Guns in 1532. These defeats were mainly due to overstretched supply lines and bad weather, but it showed that Suleiman could not go further north than Hungary. Despite these setbacks, Suleiman was still seen as a military genius, and was overall not seen as a failure. Eventually, Hungary was taken by the Ottomans in 1544, enlarging the Ottoman Empire greatly. Suleiman had campaigns throughout the empire, and was a skilled politician. In the 1530s, he gained an alliance with France in order to try and reduce the Habsburg power across Europe. Suleiman was not just successful militarily, but also supported cultural development and reformed the Ottoman Empire's legislation. Suleiman's greatest mistakes would come later in his life, when his wife, Roxalada, manipulated the Sultan into killing his most trusted advisor, Ibrahim Pasha, and later, his most capable son, Mustafa. The death of these men weakened the Ottoman Empire after his death due to weak and ill-advised sultans of the Ottoman Empire, such as Selim the Drunkard. Suleiman the Magnificent was the longest reigning sultan and he died in 1566. In EU4, you are able to play as him in 1520. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give a like and tell me what you think in the comments. Hello my children, I must give you a message. Subscribe to the Social Streamers for Eternal Salvation.